guys today we are going to learn how to install laravel on windows 10 um, laravel uh, installation process is very very simple um, you can install it on your computer very easily uh, laravel is a PSP framework um, it is an open source framework you can get it by free um, so to install laravel we need to have um, XAMPP installed, our, installed on our system I have XAMPP installed on my system uh, on C drive installed so first of all to install Laravel we need to uh, install composer to install composer go to uh, getcomposer.org site and click on download button to download the composer um, Composer setup.exe. Click on this link and download it. To install Composer, just right click on and run as administrator. I have already installed Composer, so I'm not going to install it. So you have to install Composer setup to install Laravel. Uh, it's very simple uh, to install. So after uh, our composer is successfully installed, go to command prompt and check if it, if our composer is uh, installed successfully. Uh, type composer. Hit enter. So here we go. Um, our composer is installed successfully. So we can now install Laravel project. To install Laravel project. Um, go to the Laravel uh, installation documentation. I'm going to install Laravel 5.8. Um, here is the command to install Laravel project. Copy this command and locate to your um, SD docs folder. So here we are going to uh, create our project. Uh, this blog will be your project name or you can give whatever you would like to. I am going to give it a new project name. So hit enter. So it's processing. It's gonna take a couple of time. So guys, Laravel uh, has provided very um, easy documentation to install and get started uh, with the Laravel. Um, you can go through this documentation page and uh, explore the documentations. Uh, you can find very useful links and useful documentations to um, uh, get started with Laravel and build your application. Uh, it's very uh, widely used in application development, website development. Um, it's very uh, cool framework. So there we go. Our Laravel application is installed. You can see. So let's go to our project folder underscore project and let's start our um, application by running PSP artisan serve serve our Laravel development server has started so copy this link and go to the browser paste it and let's go so here we can see our Laravel application is installed properly. Now we can uh, start uh, building our application on Laravel. 
So this is the very first page of the Laravel. Now we can build our application and starting to adding pages, um, database connections, etc. Um, so I'm gonna give you an overview of the Laravel project folders. Let's see if this is the right folder. Yeah, this is the right folder. So here we can see a lot of folders of the Laravel project. Uh, in app folder, um, we can create a controllers in HTTP in controllers folder and we can create uh, models just like user uh, PSP. this is the user model and we can create a model like user in database uh, here is the migration folder or we can create a migration uh, to create a table um, here the user table is um, generated if we run uh, migration command so the user table will be generated this is the uh, function of laravel uh, we can create a table from here so if you need to uh, create a post table you need to uh, create a migration for post first uh, like create underscore uh, post underscore table just like that here in public um, here is the css files and javascript files are located right here in resources folder um, the all the view files HTML files are located here you can see um, this is a plate template the blade template is a default Arabic, uh, template if we are going to create a home uh, page uh, home HTML uh, page then we have to create a home dot plate dot PSP in route folder um, there is a web.php here we can uh, define our routes for our application in storage um, in logs um, it is used for error logs So to connect with database um, dot env file, uh, this is the very important part. Um, right here, you can uh, uh, you have to connect database with the application. So this will be your database name, and this will be your um, username, and this will be password to connect your database with uh, your application. So guys, this is an overview of the application. It's very cool and very easy to develop application in Laravel. Um, in coming videos, I'm going to show you how to create a website in Laravel. It's very, very easy. So guys, I hope you find this uh, video very, very useful. Um, stay tuned to the channel.